Well, it just keeps happening, doesn't it? Somehow on Monday we ended up here. Didn't think it was going to happen. It's your Friday. It's my uh, Thursday, but who cares? Guess what world? We are going to finish the week of it. And what I'm going to do next, uh, I've got plenty of options, thanks to at least one very excited viewer. Um, don't know where we are. This is a weird place. Boxer Superstore. I don't think it's an actual boxing store. Pig's Peak Pharmacy. It's in English. Although, I don't know what that is. I can move, though, and actually check. So, uh, next week I'll do something else. Pig's Peak. So, what do I think this is? I don't know yet. Let's see. Observer Cops. Confiscate Judge's Dog again? I don't know. Hmm. Nothing is... Thunder test of taste. Is this like a challenge? Don't know how well your taste buds are. Okay, now we've definitely got <clears throat> a different language than English. Let's keep moving. This is quite the little marketplace here. That looks like that's heavy. My back is still hurting. We are deep in the middle of Another back pain, as I've mentioned. Oh, we're in Swaziland. Oh, we've got that answered. All right, well, Swaziland itself is not very big. They do have a KFC here. So is this Mabane? It could be a lot of places, but I'm just going to say there for now. Did we, did I, oh, oh, what was it called? The uh, Pig's Peak? Let's look for Pig's Peak. Back is still hurt <clears throat> a couple of days into the medicine, but it's just going to be a matter of actually uh, just going through with it. I mentioned that before when I broke the collarbone of like, I know eventually it'll be better. It's just the, the, the time of, you know, sitting there waiting for the bone to do its thing is the annoying part. But, you know, just don't uh, do stupid shit like I did. <clears throat> you could say every every injury is a lesson. I don't know if I even believe that myself. I gotta find out exactly where this is. If I can find a sign somewhere. I don't know if I can. That will tell me. Yes, really blur out his name. It's very important. Let's see. Um, Lakoska... Safer than STI? Like, what is this an advertisement for? I don't know. It'd be interesting to find out. Just this one little quick um, view into, like, something that is a big deal around here. It's like, oh, isn't that interesting? But then you just instantly just forget about it. I'm sure I've said that multiple times about other things I've... Uh, looked at in these maps where I'm just like, huh, I wonder how this is actually, it is to deal with this as this is your life instead of me just being like, oh, what about this? And then forget it three seconds later because I have a goldfish high veld build. I have a goldfish memory as clearly stated. I got a cough. Sorry, clearly stated multiple times. Oh, it was clearly written and I'm a... I'm an idiot. I easily could have gotten 5,000 if I tried harder. Um, my memory is trash. Like, I, I should write down things I want to talk about because I've mentioned many times at work, oh, I'll talk about this when uh, I do a video. And then as soon as video starts, nope, it just disappears. What language are you? You are Indochina, at least, in this area. We'll figure out, hopefully, a bit more. Um, like here, zoom into like this. All right. So, you got some toilet, toilets. 
Um, will this school have a flag? This is an outdoor shower bathroom? Is that the cafeteria? Is that the water tower? Is this like a... Hmm, I don't know. Let's go back this way just a bit to see if I can't see any... No, okay, I don't. Anyway, how's your week been? It's been great. I'm uh still planning a few more things for the trip I have coming up next month. I have some good ideas. Apparently, the time we're going is pretty much the dead time as far as Iceland's concerned, apparently. But hey, I'll take it. Don't have to worry with crowds because that's the worst thing. Like going to, I'll never, one of the reasons why I'll never go to Disneyland, other than I really don't care about Disneyland, <clears throat> is it's going to be crowded regardless of whenever you go. There will not be a day that it will not be crowded. It'd be way too expensive. It will not be worth it. And uh, yeah, I can find other things, more entertaining things to do with my time. I grew up next to a relatively small amusement park. It was about a hour drive, maybe hour and a half drive to it from where I was as a kid. And you'd go, there'd be times when you can go at like in summer on like a Wednesday, or you can go at like in the w fall. And you'd be like, all right, we went on the roller coaster. Uh, you guys want to go twice in a row? And you'd be like, yeah, sure. It'd be awesome. So I got to pick a place. I'm going to say just Thailand. Because I, 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 the, the scribbles, you know, pardon me for belittling your language, but those scribbles more look like scribbles here than it does in any other country. Oh, 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 I just saw you. Let's get back to the signs. Signs are always. Always helpful. Only if they're in a language I can read. And this isn't. And, you know, I haven't been to that uh, amusement park in a while. Christ, almost 15 years, maybe? Okay, yep, Thailand flag. We got it. We got it. And I know that they've expanded quite a bit. And they're still relatively small for the location it is. And I remember a thing, <clears throat> like, uh, I always blew my mind. I find it's dumb, but it seems relatively common, is that I'm used to going to an amusement park and just paying the money up front for all the rides and anything. Once I do that, it, it gives me, like, access to everything. I'm paying for this. Here's my money. I can get into any ride. Don't have to pay extra. I don't know when the trend started of nice, nice. I don't know when the trend started of actually uh, paying, but then, okay, this ride, you have to pay extra. It's like, no. That is not... What is this for? A little get-together? Are you watching a movie, or is it like a seminar? Let me see. But it's it's a... Uh, all right, yeah, I pay, but then, okay, you want to ride these? Whoa, whoa, you got to pay extra. It's like, no, I gave money to the... to the... Uh, this is Canada, potentially. And these guys, the only time I would ever consider riding a motorcycle would be in situations like this where it's, these are the best roads to drive on. They are so much fun. Look at what you got to look at. The scenery is amazing. This is awesome. But, um, let's see, can I, okay, slow. So this probably is Canada. I'm, I'm going to say it. And like games that come out now with, uh, Planet Coaster, I believe, is one where, yeah, you can make, or Roller Coaster Tycoon was another one as well, where you can just make a uh, amusement park and then, okay, I want to ride the rides. Here's an extra five bucks. No, it's like I'm paying money to be in this park. You, uh, you just let me ride everything. All right, so I don't know. God, this road looks fun. So, what do we got here? Tourist attraction. It's a heritage attraction. Some sort of attraction, I see. I don't know where in Canada this is. It might be British Columbia. I just have, I was hoping to see Caslo and Sandin. None of that helps me. Maybe these will? Historic Silvermyth and Hydroelectric Station. That doesn't help me enough. Should I dare go this way? Usually they have flags on these things. New Denver and Caslow. 
Hmm. We are getting into some dirt roads, but I am committed. Oh, I at least want to get to this museum and maybe it'll tell me. So silver mines in mountains, usually. Um, so I think we're in the Rockies. New Denver makes me feel like it's maybe here. I hopefully I've got Brit like it feels like British Columbia. That's all my I can tell you. It makes zero sense. Doesn't have to. It's just what my gut says, and I have a large one. Let me tell you. I think this may have been a bad idea. Although these roads are real fun to drive on too. I don't know if you've had chances to go on dirt roads. I grew up on one. They're a lot of fun. And I've noticed like the fun thing to do to make sure you don't like hit any giant powells is I always just got into the habit of <clears throat> mainly keeping my focus like 20 feet in front of the car. I mean, you can still see cars coming in your periphery fast. This was a bad, I'm not going to find. All right, let's, hopefully I have got enough time to turn around and get back to that main road. Let's see if I can't uh, find civilization somewhere. But yeah, this like, there's mountains here. This don't look so mountainous in Alberta. It's because it's got Skatskatskatskatskatskatskatskatskatskatskatskatskatskatskatskatskatskatskatskatskatskatskatskatskatskatskatskatskatskatskatskatskatskatskatskatskatskatskatskatskatskatskatskatskatskatskatskatskatsk
Maybe take a little tour. I'm trying to think of the Lithuanian flag right now. I can't. I believe they might still be the basketball team with all the Grateful Dead shirts, jerseys, and uniforms. I don't understand how that association was made. It was somewhere. I read the story at one point, but you can look it up and probably find a better explanation than what I could give. But I just, it was just weird that Lithuania has like Grateful Dead uniforms. Or inspired, at least. They did for a while, maybe back in the 90s. I don't know if it went through the 2000s or not. Minute left. Ah, uh, you know what? I've made my guess. You know, I think I was looking up in here. I'm not going to pretend that, that would I would have changed where I put it, because there's no way I would have. This feels non-American. I can't go over here. There is a sign here. Is this going to say South Africa to me? And no. I did not expect this. It's a highway sign, but the, the this highway sign is not really... I don't recognize it. Colonia Garantal. What is this? Give me Puerto Viejo. Isn't that a Mexican? I think that's a Mexican thing. But that highway, the highway signage here does not match up. Yeah, because that's 24? Yeah, 24. Maybe? Let me just take a look. Let's see. 24. We're we're going 24. Okay. It kind of disappears. Okay, your highway disappears. That's someone stole it. But uh, I don't I really don't think that this is I don't feel like this is Mexico. That feels like it's a sign for something and it's just and it's just far enough. I can't can't make out what that says. Well, let's, uh, like, I feel like this might be Argentina. And I've got nothing to base this off of. Yeah, I can't. Uh, nothing, nothing there. There's a lot of signage here, though. You got some potential. Yeah, it's the same stuff again. What's this one say? Peligrosa Curva. Nope. Um, let's see. We're getting... No, I want to go forward. Mouse, thank you. Try to move along to get a different section because this almost feels like Argentina. Is there... I'm, I'm, I'm going to check because I have to. Is there a... What's the high rate? Okay, the highway signs are a little different here. 27. 127. Or was it twenty? It was twenty-four. I got a minute fourteen. Twenty-four. So I'm now split between these two countries, as if you cannot tell just yet. I f okay. I found twenty-three, and then I found twenty-five. Where's twenty-four? Isn't Puerto Vieira like a? Big friggin' isn't that a big friggin' uh place here? Or am I am I just imagining things here? All right, so I am going for broke. My score be damned. I think I'm going to switch. Uh, am I gonna switch? Am I going to switch? Am I going to switch? I don't know. That guy was wearing awful puffy clothes for it to be Mexico, although Mexico City is really high up in the air. And where this highway is. Oh, God damn it. God damn it. Uh, I'm going to make it. I did it. I switched. Okay. Oh, it was Uruguay, but you know, I'll take it. Because that could have been much, much worse. <laughs> Mm-hmm. <laughs>
Oh, but hey, that was a pretty strong end to this uh, uh, Guessable World map set. May come back to it in the future. It was good enough. But congratulations, everybody. You did make it to Friday. You didn't think you could on Monday. Here we are. Just keep that in mind when Monday comes around again, when you come to watch these videos. Up on your feed. So I'm going to try to have a good weekend. I hope you do too. We'll see you soon. Goodbye.